Hello everybody, my name is John Wimble. This is the George Wimble Railway. Um, last week I went to the Hinkley Model Railway Show and I um, yeah, I acquired some more engines. Um, this is a 1400 class, 20 pound airfix. One of about 30 I've got on though. Another 20 pound one there, main line. 20 pound, standard. King George V, 20 pound. And right at the end there, Western Enterprise, again, 20 pound. Bargain. I also got the another canal boat, as you can see down there. As we come back there, as you can see, this is only on the second pour at the moment. I've got to, uh, two more pours to do to get the depth. What's coming on though, as you can see, all the stones and things are at the bottom now. I've got all the plankton in, all the ripples. So, yeah, that's looking pretty good now. Give it a bit more detail down there. Now in some places I've purposely put some bubbles in, as you can see down here. So when I put the canal boat there, it'll look like it's churning up the water. So that is actually on purpose. The embankment's almost done. I've got to do this bit here. This is this is you know that's got, that's going to be redone. But the embankment's almost done now. Look, and it works. I was really worried I didn't, didn't get the angle right, but seven degrees, perfect. So yeah, now down here, these are the, uh, unfortunately these got all damaged when I broke the old layout up. I'm going to be uh, putting another set of gates just there. So they're, they're, they're repairing it, so I'm going to try and get away with that. This is a little Scaldale bit I bought from a show, about three pounds. I'm going to try and incorporate that with a crane on it. As we come around here, what's the computers now? They're all done now, so I oh, thank God. <laughs> the town's still going there. The town is still going there. Um, as we come around the layout, we've got the wires there ready for the lights and the camera. I've got a camera inside that. Uh, more spare wiring to go into there. So we've got to pass that point there. This is all analog, not digital. Another engine there I bought recently. That's a Batman one. Same as the mainline one over there, but the Batman version. Got that from the show at Hinkley. That was uh, £7. These was a couple of quid. I just uh, again, some of these are off the old layout, some are not. I've tried to save some of the signals from the old layout, but I don't think I'll be able to save many of them, unfortunately. Yeah, it's made its reappearance. Saved him. <laughs> That's up that one, though, didn't I? Right, uh, these buildings are all off the old layout. Again, so you can see they are damaged, but I can, can try and recuperate them. I'll put these strips down there ready to put the, um, the flooring down. Uh, the church is all getting there now. That's all got lights ready to go inside it, and the sound um, box that plays the red in March. So I'll be uh, putting that inside there with a little key. Uh, main station area. Um, started slabbing it all down now. I was going to do it like this, but I'll just change my mind. I'm it all slabs going that way, so they're going to be gone over today. So I'm putting the slabs down that way. Uh, but it looks pretty good. Um, and the front end is going to be like that up there. Started doing that bit now. Got a little stairs area here. This is my first scratch built platform, so do do bear with me. You can see it's all made out of j jigsaw boxes, but you get the general idea. This is a scratch build platform there. You can see it's all jigsaw boxes and bits and bobs. Uh, that's why it's a bit uh, here and there. Now I haven't done these flat to the ground. Uh, to add a bit more realism, I've done these strips across there to make them look like they're slightly uneven. So um, hopefully that'll work out nice. But yeah, it's uh, it's coming on nice now. So I've got a lot more work to do. I think about another year and a half, probably two years. I don't know. Depends on you know how much time, funds, and money comes into it. But yeah, it's getting there though. Uh, it's usable now. Uh, the lines are all working. Um, I've not tried the um, 
two sidings yet or these ones here because I need to um, put some isolation pieces in I'm just going to do that with a, with a Dremel and just put a, like a little bloody switch across it yeah it's easy isn't it um, otherwise yeah it's coming on nice starting to put some of the fencing back in this is again this is all this is all stuff from the old layout I'm trying to, just trying to recuperate and save as much as possible um, for nostalgia purposes if, if, if no tells but yeah it's coming on nice now but so these new engines oh well 20 20 pound and they was a bargain they all work and they're it's, it's unusual for a set of, you know second hand engines being in such great condition but this one here this one is it's, it's, it's in lovely condition it's and look it's an old one but it wallops around it's brilliant it's a lovely lovely condition so yeah very happy with that one and the king george v well that just bombs around that does yeah, I mean, it took that corner at Christ knows what speed. Yeah, but yeah. It's coming on now, though. You can see a lot of work up there, but it's... Would you worry about the hairspray, by the way? Brilliant for scatter. Put your glue down, spray it with that. Fantastic. You, you know, it's, it's brilliant stuff. Can't beat ha the hairspray to stick it down with. But, uh, yeah, it's uh, coming on nice now. The wagons at the back, the blue ones, the, the, sorry, the brown ones, they're all um, from the Lupa show this year. So uh, yeah, there's a lot of new engines on, on the way. But yeah, it's kind of nice now. I've, put, I've just put these on there to get the... Um, make sure I've got all the angles on the platform right. Yeah, it's just so much you're not going to catch anywhere and stuff like that. Which you know, it probably will do. There's a little bit there. Like, woo, sticking down there. But uh, yeah, I'm just getting the more detailing done now. You can see here. It's all detailing work coming in. So yeah, it's quite nice now. I'll say about another year, probably a year and a half. Um, hopefully that'll be done by then. This will be done by mid-summer time, I think, there's a lot of costs there. But yeah, it's uh, it's quite nice now. The station will be the, also be the first one being to be finished off. Uh, at least this platform here, by December, I think. This area here will be done by, by December. Probably January, February time for this area. This one, that won't take long at all now. That's almost done now. Uh, so, so the second pour, um, detailing some of the little boats and the work on down here. Crane and this back bit here will probably be more more like that. More like these hills there. The, the main big hill, that's going to take a long time. That'll be about another about three months just to make that. That's going to be a big, big hill with like um, lift up areas and get into it. The hidden line works fine, as you can see down there. Yeah, that looks works fine now. So yeah, it's all happy days and jobs are good and way. <laughs> so this is me, John Well was saying um thanks for subscribing, keep you know, I will try and keep as much as possible. You can see I've got a lot of work on. I mean I've been as you can see down there, look. Yeah, there's a lot of engines and bits and bobs still to move into here from the uh, old layout, so but I've got my little workbench sorted out now though, so I can do that now. And then the good old trusty um H and M's, so yeah. Um, just wish me the best of luck and I'll see what I can pump out for you and some, some locos working on hopefully um, well, yeah, this is John Wellman saying thanks a lot and uh, thank you for wishing me a, ha a happy birthday I really appreciate it um, more trains are on the way as I say like, hopefully well by Friday so yeah that's the new stuff I've got anyway and uh, obviously see more on the way yeah. <laughs> this is me saying, saying goodbye for now and um, cheers for subscribing to me Goodbye now. Bye-bye.